Hello everyone. Today in series of Doplex Scale interviews, we have with us Dr. S K Sharma, who is an endocrinologist from Jaipur. Thank you, doctor, for this interview. Uh, so let's begin with the first question. Uh, what is GLP-1 analog, and where are they present in therapy of diabetes? Well, GLP-1 group of drugs are a unique group of drugs. Since they are injectable drugs, they are uh, modified in such a way that the normal GLP-1, which is released from our body, is destroyed within a period of two minutes by DPP-4 enzymes. But when you modify them, their duration of action is prolonged, and then we can give them either once a day or even now uh, newer drugs are given once a week, and they are placed in our uh, armamentarium for the diabetes as a second line drug with metformin most of the time. But if the patient is not tolerating metformin, we can even start them as a monotherapy with life and lifestyle modification, and even you can use them as a third line drug when the patient is already on like sulfonylurea, metformin and any other combination of drugs and then you can get very good response. Okay. Uh, so doctor, what are the effects and side effects of GLP-1 analog? Well, these are anti-diabetic drugs. So the first effect is that they reduce glucose effectively. So HUA1C reduction is to the tune of 1.2 to 1.5 and they also causes weight reduction. They are very cardio, cardio friendly. They are, uh, you can say, uh, have some beneficial effect on the kidney function also. They have some more pleiotropic effects which are useful in the management of our diabetic patients. Okay, uh, so doctor moving on to the next one. So uh, extra glycemic effect of uh, GLP-1 agonists. Yeah. So um, can you please uh, talk yeah. about it? Now uh, more and more uh, studies are telling us that in addition to reduction in HbA1c, there are many more benefits of GLP-1 receptor agonist therapy. One important area is weight reduction. So now most of these studies are telling us a weight reduction of 2 to 5.5 uh, kg and uh, liraglutide particularly when given in larger doses like 3 mg by the name of Saxenda is now considered to be an anti-obesity drug, a weight reducing drug where you are giving 3 mg of liraglutide once a day subcutaneously. Then most of these studies were telling us that there is a weight reduction of something like 5 kg or so. Only 30% of patients are not able to show any significant weight reduction. Okay. Another important thing is cardiovascular outcome. So in COVT trials with GLP-1 receptor agonists, we have seen that they significantly reduce major adverse cardiovascular events. Like in leader trial, liraglutide was able to reduce 13% MACE. And then this was mainly because of the cardiovascular death that is reduced by 21%. Similarly, with uh, other drugs like semaglutide, which is once a day, well, sorry, once a week uh, drug, is reducing MACE by 26%. Similarly, dulaglutide is also in award studies telling us that these drugs are also reducing significant MACE outcome. So cardiovascular benefits are there. Secondly. There are uh, studies which tells us that they reduce renal outcome, they reduce protein urea, they are cytoprotective, they are neuroprotective, they reduce the size of infarct in uh, myocardial infarction, they are having some beneficial effect even in the bone. Diabetic patients are having more osteoporosis, so they have improvement in uh, cortical and uh, trabecular bone structure and have some benefits there also. So when you uh, mentioned about drugs for uh, obesity, so yeah. how does that go along with uh, lifestyle modification for the patient? Well, whenever a patient of obesity comes, the primary aim is to have lifestyle modification. Yeah. But as you know, it is very difficult yeah, right. and in many of our patients, it may not give you good res results. That's why we sometimes combine them with any anti obesity drug so and one of the one of the, the yeah obesity. one of that drug is now saxenda huh. but it is not yet available in india it okay. is at present available in usa oh, right. 3 mg of liraglutide given once a day is okay. saxenda
Okay, thank you so much, Doctor. It was a pleasure thank having you here. Thank you.